When it comes to standard gas-powered motorcycles, first of all, you remember the roar of powerful engines, the smell of hot metal and gasoline, as well as the wind, which gives you that feeling of freedom. But over the last few years, as it's happening in the automotive industry, the motorcycle industry is increasingly concentrating on the latest technologies, primarily on the use of electric motors. Today's video will be dedicated to the most powerful and fastest electric motorcycles. So, don't forget to wear your helmet, subscribe to the channel, and let's get right into it! Italian manufacturers have always been famous for their ability to combine elegant and attractive design and advanced technology with a desire for maximum performance. For several years now, Energica Ego, born in the same Italian city as the famous Vespa scooters, has been at the forefront of the ranking of the most powerful and sophisticated electric motorcycles on the streets all over the world. The company that has already achieved 62% more battery capacity for a combined riding range of 143 miles now offers the RS version of its high-power Ego Plus model, underlining even more racing-derived performance. The RS version features drivetrain updates and new mapping and parameterization improvements of the vehicle control unit to deliver an impressive 0-60 mph acceleration time of 2.6 seconds. The fully electric oil-cooled motor with the power of 107 kilowatts helps achieve a top speed of 150 miles per hour. The Ego Plus RS will be available in the US for $25,000. What the Canadian electric startup Damon Motorcycles offers is not a simple bike, but a whole riding system with a unique user experience. The Damon Hypersport is equipped with distinguished LED headlights as well as 3D printed body details, Brembo brakes, and Olin suspension. All their motorcycles are provided with the unique AI enhanced warning system, which can detect dozens of objects in 360 degree around the motorcycle and will alert the rider by visual and tactile signals if any threat is found. The overall performance of Damon Hypersport motorcycles could be described by three 200s. They are coming with an electric motor of 200 horsepower that allows acceleration in less than 3 seconds and a top speed of 200 miles per hour. And finally, a full single charge could provide an astonishing up to 200 miles of combined riding range. The base Damon Hypersport HS is priced at $25,000, while the premier version costs $40,000. The impressive appearance of the Zero SRS is completely inspired by the modern aerospace design and reflects the core spirit of electric motorcycles. A dedicated app comes to connect the rider with its two-wheel horse, offering wide access to the most important data about the motor, the battery, and the overall performance of the motorbike. Like its sibling bike, the Zero SRF, the SRS is powered by the known Z-Force 7510 motor, delivering 82 kilowatts output to reach a top speed of 124 miles per hour. With a 14.4 kilowatt hour battery pack, it can achieve a combined riding range of 123 miles. Besides, an optional power tank can provide an additional 30 miles in the mixed mode. Due to its aerodynamic design and riding geometry, the company refers to the SRS as the most comfortable sports bike on the road. Unfortunately, there is not exact acceleration data unveiled yet, but Zero SRS seems to be even more impressive than the SRF, which can hit 60 miles per hour in around 3 seconds. The selling price depends mostly on the charging system, available either with a 3 kW or a 6 kW option and starting at $20,000, while the premium variant costs $22,000. True excitement and a whirl of speed. These are the feelings that catch you when riding a Lightning LS218. It's the first electric bike that managed to reach an incredible top speed of 218 miles per hour. The result that Lightning has achieved for many years is provided mostly by the 150 kilowatts liquid-cooled permanent magnet electric motor with 168 pound-feet of torque. The top-end version is offered with a 380 volt 20 kilowatt hour battery pack for a combined average riding range of 170 miles. 
Such a combination of the top-notch technical specs allows the LS218 to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 2.2 seconds, and from 0 to 100 miles per hour in 5.5 seconds. However, in order to saddle this premium two-wheel electric horse, it will be necessary to pay around $39,000, which is comparable to the price of mass-market electric vehicles. But there is no place for disappointment, as Lightning Motorcycles has started reservations for another electric model named Lightning Strike. This much more affordable motorcycle promises impressive specs and comes in a handful of attractive colors. Although it's less powerful than the LS218, the Strike enters the market with a much friendlier price range of $13,000 to $19,900, which, along with a combined riding range of 150 miles, could attract many new riders. The Livewire sport bike is designed to establish the legendary Harley-Davidson as one of the main actors in the market of electrified two-wheel vehicles. This all-electric motorcycle comes to maintain the brand awareness among young riders as well as to enlarge the market share endangered under attacks of old and new competitors. The instant torque provided by the HD Revelation powertrain is enough for Livewire to boost from 0 to 60 miles per hour in about 3 seconds while the battery pack provides a single-charge combined riding range of approximately 100 miles. With around 250 kilograms weight, the maneuvering is a little bit challenging, but overall the bike performs great and provides an emotional riding experience. Harley-Davidson Livewire is available for about $30,000, but that could be fair enough for a well-made premium sport bike with a bunch of features that go far beyond expectations. Since its unveiling back in 2018, the Arc Vector has got continuous improvement and is characterized by an innovative approach to both design and technical specifications, including a distinctive carbon fiber monocoque and all-new hub center steering due to the front swing arm suspension in place of traditional telescopic forks. All these solutions are aiming at increasing the overall performance, though the Arc Vector is not the fastest e-motorcycle in the world. In addition to these solutions, the company offers a truly unprecedented information system, a human-machine interface, including a special, projection-based, heads-up display helmet similar to fighter pilot systems, as well as a tech-embedded jacket to provide haptic feedback warnings. As to the technical specs, the Arc Vector comes with a 95 kilowatts electric motor, which is enough to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.2 seconds and reach an electronically limited top speed of 125 miles per hour. It's expected to achieve a riding range of up to 200 miles, depending on use. Arc Vector, the first customer deliveries of which will begin in winter 2021, is positioned as a high premium product may be unique of its sort, so you will need about $123,000 to enjoy its exclusiveness. The French iconic brand Voxan Motors has refocused on developing electric motorcycles after being acquired by high-performance electric vehicle developer Venturi. The company has unveiled the specially designed Wattman Superbike, which, coming actually in three forms, has already set 11 new world records, ridden by six-time motorcycle racing world champion Max Biaggi. The on-road version delivers 150 kilowatts power output, generating an instant 148 pound-feet of torque. The result is 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration time of 3.4 seconds. Instead of a frame, it has an ultra-rigid aluminium exoskeleton that integrates all of the powertrain components. To unleash the bike's capabilities, the company has also designed a special high-performance version of the Wattman, which has already claimed the title of the fastest electric motorcycle in the world by hitting a speed of 254 miles per hour. It uses a dry ice cooling system and is equipped with a 270 kilowatts Mercedes Formula E race car motor powered by a 15.9 kilowatt hour battery. 
But the adventure doesn't end here. The company intends to update its own record on the Salar de Uyuni salt flat in Bolivia in summer 2021. After all, the purpose-built tires can withstand a speed of 450 km per hour. The company has plans to produce a limited number of units for sale, but the time is not yet clear. The world of electric motorcycles is continuously growing, so we can wait for new astonishing models in the nearest future. Let us know what your favorite e-moto is from today's list and see you in the next video.